What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I want to talk about something that is being noticed on these 2020s. I want to key you in on something that I'm seeing and hearing. If you guys own a 2020 and you are doing work on your truck, you guys might want to watch this. All right, let's do it. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are here once again with a power stroke, very important six, seven tidbit. Now something that I have been seeing and hearing about from you guys, I've heard of people um, doing work on their trucks. And one gentleman in particular had to replace his fuel system because he accidentally put death in the system and had to tear you know his EGR cooler off and his upper intake and um, vice versa with other technicians when we're repairing these things you guys need to pay attention now we're gonna get up here and I want to zoom in get close hone in turn the light on and I want you guys to pay attention there are three very important sensors on diesels. All power strokes. Our pressure sensors are huge. Exhaust back pressure, manifold absolute pressure, and barrow. Map and EBP. Barrow sometimes is integrated into the mass airflow sensor. On six liters, there is a little box underneath the dash. Sometimes it's in the computer. So with that said, paying attention to your EBP and your map sensor. Let's see if I can get, there we go, we can focus. Three wires right there. These are interchangeable. You can plug the map into the EBP and the EBP into the map. If you guys notice on this part of the harness, you have a tether a zip tie with a Christmas tree clip in it that tethers right to this spot on the upper intake manifold. The EBP sensor wiring does not. Although these do plug in and they do read pressures, this is supposed to be reading atmospheric. Anybody know what atmospheric is? Yep, 14.7. That is what's pressing down on all of us right now currently. We have 14 PSI pressing down on us and that is zero. 14.7 is our baseline. That is our zero. So anything above 14.7 is going to indicate pressure. So although the, both these sensors were reading PSI, they were just not reading the correct PSI for the given time. This is supposed to be increasing at a different rate than this is supposed to be increasing. And the PCM knows that. So note to all technicians and all you guys out there that are repairing your trucks, doing whatever, repairing your trucks, make sure to plug in the correct sensor. You all can see right here, all the map sensors are blue. These ones, just one's blue. Map sensor has a tether, the EBP does not. Obviously you need to run the tethered wire right in front of there. Let me know if this is ever stumbled you guys if you've ever ran into this or heard it it's something that is very important if you guys are going to be messing around with this trio of wiring right here let me know in the comment section remember to like comment sub share and i'll catch you guys all next time see ya.